My name is Emma Nishimura, and I'm an artist. I work a lot in printmaking. I do a lot of sculpture and installation-based work. I've always loved printmaking. I fell in love with the process and the possibilities inherent to print. For all these different ways of working, there's a structure and a process to follow. And then it was learning how to break out of those molds and how I could challenge myself and create different things. Using printmaking as the base, but working with historic photographs and then turning those into my own art. There's so much play, and I think for me, that's where I really revel in the process. A lot of my work is working from this one framework of a story, and then it's how can I tell different stories. So print gives me a starting point, and then things kind of evolve from there. So I started off working with traditional print, and then out of that grew a desire to cut the prints up and assemble them differently, create multiple things, and then display kind of all of them together. So it was this natural progression to work to installation. Some of my pieces now incorporate audio elements. It was about creating an atmosphere for viewers to be immersed in my work. And so to take it off of the wall directly, and how can people interact with it, move around it, and really be surrounded by it. The work that I submitted for the Queen Sonia Print Award was really a spectrum of work that I've been creating over the last eight to 10 years. The work is really about my grandparents' story being interned as Japanese Canadians during the war. I've been immersed in those stories and I've carried those around with me for my whole life. And so to create work that cultivated that experience how do we hold those? How do they weigh on us? To win the Queen Sonia Print Award is a remarkable thing, and I'm so deeply grateful and incredibly honored to be the recipient. Up until now, my work has only been shown in Canada and the United States, so to receive this award means that my work can be seen on a much broader international stage, and for me, that's such an amazing gift. I'm in awe of the appreciation and the respect that Her Majesty Queen Sonia and the Foundation are giving to printmaking. <laughs>